River State Governor Simnalai Fubara arriving at Okrika local government area. On this Monday, the governor has come to inspect remodeling work at the once famous Okrika Grammar School. During its glory days, OGS, as it was fondly called, was one of the most sought after secondary schools in the state. Following several years of neglect, all that the school has to show for nurturing several prominent and successful river sons is its decaying infrastructure. But the fortunes of the school are about to change as the Fubara administration has embarked on a total overhaul of the facilities. We are touched by the very deplorable state of the, the former school and our government decided that we should give it a festive. And uh, since after the award of that, that uh, contract, we have not visited here. So we are doing it today. The governor is not happy with the pace and quality of work done so far. Okrika is there to me. So I need to see for myself the extent of job and uh, the standard too. My assessment have to be very raw. I'm not satisfied. That's the truth. The commissioner gave me the impression that 70% uh, job has been done. From what I'm saying here, I need to take over the supervision of this project to make sure I give my people a standard, when I say standard, a standard grammar school again. Based on that, Governor Fubara has decided to read the Riot Act to contractors handling all government projects in the state. Before the end of this week, I'll have a meeting with all the contractors to read my Riot Act to them because I've paid 100% of this project. Am I lying? Mm -hmm. uh, so if I've paid 100% and this is the state of the, the work, then I need to do something about it. The quality must match the amount that we spend. You know, I'm somebody who has to do with figure. So there must be value for money. And by the end, our people need to be happy that we have done this and I also need to be happy that I did what is needed for our people. Monday also sees the River State Governor inspecting work on the 9.5 billion Naira Woji Aletu Alesa to the Potako Refinery Road project. When completed, the road will serve as an alternative route to Okrika as well as cut travel time to the strategic oil and gas free zones housing the Potaka refineries, the Oner Deep Sea Port and other petrochemical industries located in that axis.